We hopefully we can reduce the length of stay in hospital. We can hopefully reduce the use of intensive care bed days. For example, using the robot can sometimes avoid doing open surgery. And if we can reduce all these uh, long admissions with intensive care, that, that can really help the patients. When you're at the console, obviously you're uh, away from the, the patient in the corner, so you're a wee bit away from the action, but you can hear on the microphone what's happening and uh, we can still communicate to each other uh, what's going on. We've also got um, a, a sort of surgical team at the patient side that are operating in, in through the mouth at the same time, so we're all working together. Early cancer detection is so important with head and neck cancer, like most other cancers, but if we can diagnose the patients early, get them started in treatment early, we know that they do better, they have better outcomes. I'm quite surprised, you know, I mean, y y when you think you're going to get these kind of operations on, on your throat especially, you know, you think, oh my God, am I going to be able to talk, am I going to be able to eat, am I going to be able to... And, and I can do everything. It's a little bit tender, but yeah, I'm quite impressed.